everybody. So we have another day off today. Again, it's part of our long weekend. So we thought we'd bring you something spicy, spicy. today on today's home vlog. So we, last month, we signed up for the subscription box. A Heatonist uh, hot sauces, like monthly hot sauces. They send you three every month. Right now we have a line of sauces. Half of these were from October subscription box and then the other half we're from November subscription box. Yeah, so you can buy the hot sauces individually. You can buy different like spice level boxes of hot sauces, or you can sign up for the monthly subscription box. Uh, that's $30 a month plus the cost of shipping. Hashtag not sponsored. Yeah, we're not sponsored by Heatness. We just thought it'd be something fun for you and questionable at best on the fun scale for me today. We watch the Hot One show on YouTube a lot mm -hmm. and a lot of these sauces are from it. There are two new sauces. The Apollo sauce, the hottest scale on the new season on Hot Ones. Mm -hmm. And then the November box got this brand new spicy honey. It's called Nugget Honey. Yeah, we, we also have uh, the Da Bomb Evolution on here. So the Line in the lineup number eight is always the da bomb beyond insanity. This is a different uh, iteration of da bomb. So per the box, it says that it's the same sauce just with more flavor. Which on the show, people just say it's just hot. So we're excited to try this new one as well. The boxes also come with brand new stickers, like the Apollo sticker and this like honey pot sticker, and then just the heatnest. Uh, badge yeah the logo so we're gonna go to wingstop and get our wings again not sponsored and we'll see you guys in a little bit and here is our final lineup we have all of the sauces laid out trying to get from the best increasing scoville unit intensity yep so the bottle on the left is the lowest on the scoville scale so the least spicy and then we have them lined up toward the right to the most spicy, which is the last dab of Apollo. The, the Nugget Honey is made with Pepper X, and there, we couldn't really find an actual Scoville unit for it. But it says that it, it's an intensity of 4 out of 10. Yeah, so the Pepper X is supposed to be more spicy than the Carolina Reaper. But mixed with the honey sweetness, it tones it down a lot. So with the 4 out of 10, that's just kind of where we put it. We also got a really good use for our uh, pass holder cutting board here with Chef Mickey on it. And we'll go over each of these sauces as we go through it. Before we get into all the sauce madness, we just wanted to say we have safety precautions. We have each a glass of milk. We got some ranch cups. And we are in the safety of our own home. So if we need any sort of accoutrements, we have it available to us at all times. Like a bathroom. I'm terrified of this. I'm doing it. I'm doing it, but I'm taking little bites and I will tap out if I need to. And I'm going all the way. Of course you are. <laughs> <laughs> Is it bad that I can smell them and I already want to be drinking milk? Like that's, that's not a good sign. I mean, Is it? I probably shouldn't have put all the sauces on your side. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This is the first hot sauce that we are trying. This is Dawson's Shawarma Sauce. This is the second hot sauce lineup on season 13 of Hot Ones. Made with cayenne pepper, garlic, other spices, along with honey and olive oil. Uh, this one's 4200 on the Scoville scale, just to kind of put that in relation a jalapeno pepper can be anywhere from 2,500 to 8,000 on the Scoville scale, so it falls right in that range. And this has a really nice accent on it. It has a wax seal on top with the D in Dawson. All right, first sauce. Clink. Clink. I like how you put the whole thing in your mouth. <laughs> I just went for it. I'm not going for it that hard. I like it. It's a good sauce. If this is number one, I'm doomed. You're doomed? Yeah. So this is called the shawarma sauce. I never actually knew what shawarma was until the first Avengers movie. Did you know that? No. Yeah, they have a whole scene remember. about it. Oh? Uh, the very end well, of it. He's like, I need it. to get shawarma. Now I gotta watch it. I'm already going for the milk. 
Next sauce that we have is Shaquanda's West Indian Curry Hot Sauce. This is the third lineup on season 13 Hot Ones. This is made with uh, scotch bonnet peppers and then uh, it's kind of a Caribbean sauce with the West Indian spices. This one's 14,000 on the Scoville scale. Number two? Number two. Okay. Mm. I definitely get that curry spice mm -hmm. in this one. These are, so far I've already had really good flavors to them. Mm -hmm. I like this one a lot. I remember seeing this on the show and I'm like, Michelle, I really, 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 really want that sauce. Do you like the shawarma better though? I think the shawarma is so far my favorite. This definitely has a more kick to it, but. Yeah, we should probably add in, in our first box, um, the first and second ones that we just tried were already in there. So David's been using that on different things in our everyday life. Mm -hmm. So we're kind of, well, he is used to these two, but. It's my first time trying them. I think I like the first one better also, the shawarma sauce. Like but... it, not only is it just like the least hot of them so far, mm -hmm. it's just got a really good flavor. It does, yeah. Third sauce on our lineup is Nugget Honey. The sauce is was just released in November. Brand new hot sauce that's not even on the Hot Ones lineup. Made with Pepper X. Yeah, so it's really more of a honey than a actual hot sauce, but the Pepper X has a really high Scoville over even the Carolina Reaper, um, but this hun the honey is supposed to balance it out really well to give this sweet to go with the spicy. On the third one, I am really excited about this. So in the boxes, they pretty much keep the sauces hidden until the box gets to you. This, the honey sauce, is was announced pretty much a couple days before. When did they started shipping? Yeah. So no one knew about it, and this sauce is, I don't even know, spicy honey? I'm excited for the spicy part. I'm terrified for the pepper X part, but when we when they announced they were going to do it, I was looking up, it, it talked about like mixing it in cocktails and different things like that. So we've been doing some research yeah. on different things we can make, so maybe coming up you may be seeing some honey cocktails on and a future vlog. And even said like on ice cream? Uh, I'm not on my ice cream. Alright, here we go. Clink. <laughs> oh, sweet honey, but now the burn is coming. That's delicious. I'm dabbing on the sauce that's still yeah, sitting there. The honey just kind of oozed off of the wing and we got some extra sauce here. I will say that there is a burn, but the sweetness of this is amazing. This has some really good flavor. This, so the last one that we did had like a 3 out of 10. This has a 4 out of 10, but this one's not as nearly as hot as the other one. That, no. That sweetness of the honey really balances that. Yeah, that is so good. And when I first bit into it, like you instantly get that sweet, like kind of like that ice creamy, like would be good a good mm -hmm. topping for that. Just a really sweet honey flavor and right when i said i feel the burn it just started slowly burning in the back of my throat not overwhelming at all because we've established that i do not like spicy food that much but i mean it's good this is this is top one for me like the shawarma i'm sorry but oh this is great this is fantastic the next sauce that we have is the bomb evolution hot sauce this is a variant version of the bomb Beyond Insanity, the hot sauce is normally eighth on the lineup on the hot ones. This is supposed to be an all-natural variant of that hot sauce. It's supposed to have uh, red hot chili peppers is what's listed on there. But if you look online, it says scorpion peppers. And then it has spices like uh, paprika and turmeric. Halfway point, how you feeling? I'm feeling okay, but I'm a little terrified because I drank half of my milk already. And yeah. I haven't even touched mine. Yeah, of course you haven't. I'm going to tap in yours if I need to. So uh, the first three sauces that we did were on the heat, uh, the hot one show. Our numbers two, three, and then the honey one is the bonus one. 
The next three we're going to do are, are the 8th, ninth, and 10th one of the line. Like the highest hotness that they have on the show. Yeah, so this isn't the exact da bomb Beyond Insanity that they have in the number 8 spot. But it is, a, like I said, a different variant of that. So uh, Michelle brought her spoon so she can scoop ranch into her mouth. I'm doing it. No judge. No judge. Sauce 4. Oh, I have the babiest baby piece on the face of the planet. And I'm just throwing this down. No holding back, baby. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I regret all my choices in life. <laughs> oh. Whoa! That's... So this is the, the meme sauce of the whole show that pretty much they have like compilations of the show of like celebrities crying over the bomb. I get how they <laughs> it cry. Just, <laughs> it just, you, you feel it burning instantly and as soon as it gets to the back of your throat, it's like you need a fire extinguisher. Woo! Okay. But if that is the better tasting one, I can't imagine what the original one's no, supposed to taste like. that's horrible. It's not horrible, it's just so hot. Yeah. Whew. Flavor is hot. It's hot. Um, I like the flavor, flavor is good, but there becomes a point where people who aren't in the spice, it just is just hot. It's just hot for her, I can kind of get like the different tones of flavors they have under it. I can't name them, but I can taste them. They're kind of just... Uh, I can name them, but they're not words I can say. <laughs> <laughs> Next on our lineup is Pucker Butt Pepper Company's Chipotle Express. Pepper X is in this hot sauce. So Pepper X is what they use in the last dab, the famous last dab that's been up until season 12. Um, this one also also has um, chipotle, lime, and honey in it. Um, it's listed online with a Scoville scale of 669,000. This is number five. While we pause this to cut the next wing, I reloaded on milk. I've blown my nose. I still really can't feel my tongue, but how are you doing? The bomb is still in my throat, and I'm about to throw some more spice on top of it. Yeah. This is, we'll find out why it's called Pucker Butt. <laughs> <laughs> Are those seeds floating in there? Like what is floating in there? Seeds. This one at least I feel like has better flavor. Like it's burning me, but I okay, think, now it's just burning. I'm somehow doing better on this one. And I don't know, it's just because the bomb is just, it just burnt all my taste buds. I'm, I'm my, almost like slurring. I'm using my spoon, mouse Oh boy. Oh boy. The ranch really doesn't do anything. It's just like in my head. <laughs> I think it's good. It's hot. The flavor. There's flavor in this one compared to the last one that was just bad words. But I'm literally salivating. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> yeah. Woo. Okay. You're a champion because I'm... <sighs> wow. Wow. Right. This is hotter than I've ever gone before. Like, I don't even know that I've lived in this realm before of the not spicy ones. So, I don't know how you do this. But, Kudos. Oh, thank you. Kudos to you for even doing it with me. But we I'm... got one more sauce left. Ah! Now, finally, at the end, we have reached the Last Dab Apollo. This is a variant of the original Last Dab hot sauce that was in seasons 1 through 12 on Hot Ones. This is made with the brand new Apollo hot pepper. Yeah, so the Apollo pepper is a combination of the Carolina Reaper and the Pepper X that was in our last hot sauce. 
Um, it's estimated, so the Carolina Reaper is officially, per Guinness World Records, the world's hottest pepper at 2 million Scoville. So this is supposed to be 3 million, 2 million plus. Definitely it's supposed to be hotter. All right, per Sean Evans, it's tradition around here to do one last dab on the last wing. So I guess I'm going to do one. Oh, God. Regurts. You want to do some? No. Oh, okay. All right. Cheers to the last wing. I'm not clinking it because I don't want any of that. Oh, you don't want any more? All right, no. here we go. Oh. Okay. Oh. So this one's pretty special because it just sat in my mouth for a little bit and it had some pretty good flavor to it. And now the heat is just slowly taking larger and larger steps. I was steps. getting ready to make very good comments about this. And then it hit me like a ton of bricks. And it's the, the heat is so potent wherever it just touched my tongue is where it's burning. It's not taking any other part of my tongue or my mouth. It's just wherever it touched, that's the hot spot. I don't know if you could feel that. I can't feel anything. Oh. <laughs> wow. Your oh. nose is running like, <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> All right. How do you feel? I'm alive. We did it! Confetti! Yay. Whee! Whee! Oh boy. Would you do the next gauntlet with me? Probably, because if I survive this, I'm sure I can survive that. I can't really feel my tongue. Everything is dripping. But I you can say it. I did it. We did it. So, I guess we wait for the next box to come in. Yeah, they've been shipping around the 19th of every month, getting here a few days after that. So it just came, our November box just came in the mail today. The next one will be coming around Christmas. Christmas. So we'll see you guys next in December during our Hot Ones Challenge. Mm -hmm.